It's We Wow Week. Right away, Houston. <laughs> Happy holidays, Wowzers, from the Wow on Wheels. Mindy, stop! A rolling thunder of wow and holiday wonder. Mindy, Mindy, you drove right past me. What? What? Obviously. Uh, what happened to the reindeer? Oh, I decided to give them the day off since they quit. They what? So now my sleigh cats are pulling this thing since I ran out of gas and also the engine fell out of the truck. Oh, oh, oh hi, kitties. Uh, I see you're helping Mindy spread the holiday cheer. Come on, get in, Guy Raz. I need your help. What's up, Mindy? Well, I told the sleigh cats that if they pulled the wow on wheels for us, they could have a snowball fight later. You promised cats a snowball fight? Yes. Mindy! I know, I know. Snowballs are people, too, and we should not be giving them to cats to throw at each other. No, I was just going to say, uh, there's no snow on the ground. <sighs> and also, there's no snow on the ground. What? Sorry, Mindy, uh, but for snow to form, the temperature outside needs to be below freezing. Ah, freezing. So zero degrees Celsius or 32 degrees Fahrenheit? Exactly. And for snow to stick to the ground and build up, the ground usually has to be freezing or at least close to freezing. Man, you're telling me that because it's not freezing outside, those little water vapors and the clouds can't freeze and turn into tiny ice crystals? Nope. Ugh, how am I ever going to make good on my promise to these sleigh cats, Guy Raz? Well, you could make snow. Make snow? Or your own version of it. You know, one that doesn't rely on freezing outside temperatures. Okay, okay. So how do I do it, Guy Raz? How do I make fake snowballs for my sleigh cats? And how do I make enough for all seven of them? Well, I could tell you. Yes? But I'd rather show you. Hey, that's my line. Here, wait. Let me grab my ingredients. I'll be right back. Wow in the world. Hey, Roz. Hurry up. The sleigh cats are getting restless. <sighs> okay. Okay, Mindy. I think I've got everything we need to make fake snow. Great. But in order to make enough for a proper sleigh cat snowball fight, you're going to need some help. Hmm. Well, maybe we can get the wowzers of the world to help out. Huh. Just tell me what we need to do, Guy Raz, and I'll tell them. Oh, great idea. Let me grab my megaphone here. <laughs> Attention, wowzers of the world. I need you to help me make some snowballs. What do we need, Guy Razzie? Well, first, we're going to need one cup of baking soda. One cup of baking soda! And one cup of shaving cream. One cup of shaving cream! Next, you're going to combine these two ingredients by mixing them together with a fork. Mix the shaving cream and baking soda. Together with a shark. A fork, Mindy, a fork. I mean, a fork. And finally, you'll want to mix in a few drops of water. Dump in a few gallons of water. Drops of water, Mindy, drops. Sorry, scratch that. Drops of water. And keep mixing until you've got what looks and feels like a pile of snow. And keep mixing until it turns into snow. And you can experiment with what would happen if you mixed in more baking soda or more shaving cream or more water. Ah, uh, what he said. And when you finish your snowballs, share them with us so I can keep my promise to the sleigh cats. Oh, and tell your grown-ups they can upload pictures and videos of your snowballs to tinkercast.com slash share. Got that? It's tinkercast.com slash share. Turning science into snowballs. Thanks for your help, Guy Raz. Snow problem, Mindy. Wait, did you just say... Uh, <laughs> who wows? We wow! Snowball fight! <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Mindy! Sorry. <laughs>